welcome back to Our Family Bee. I'm Brigitte, and with the help of my two little friends here today, AKA my children, we're gonna tell you about 15 things that are great kids gifts, especially if you're looking last minute to shop online. So let's get into the video. A great gift idea for kids is Legos. They have the Duplo kind, which is bigger blocks like this, and they also have the regular size, which we have a ton of, and this used to be organized until you know the kids got a hold of it, and now it is so unorganized, and it's all over the place, and we need to have another little organizing session because I'm stepping on them again. Legos are so great because they encourage imagination and building and you can actually do it with your kids. So Benjamin has found out that he really loves following the directions on the Lego kit. So he's made like, I mean this has no wheels, but little trains and like all the stuff that comes in each kit. And then you can also go online to look up the rest of the instructions on certain ones and you can get a whole ton more that you can build with the same Legos that are in that kit. So he's really been enjoying them. He's five years old and it's something that he could do on his own now, which is awesome because then it frees me up to do other things. But it's also something I can do with him, which is really cool. So if you're looking for imaginative play, Lego blocks are the way to go. Brielle has actually been enjoying the Duplo kind, which is this size. Again, little scenes that you can get and put together and stuff like that. We use them all like interchangeably. So we have like a train, but Benjamin was playing with it, you know, with the airplane and all the people and stuff like that. But even she loves to play with those. And the big mega blocks, which Brielle has loved playing with, and she's almost two. Next month, she'll be two in January. So any of those size of Legos are great. And so I would definitely recommend, if you're looking for a gift for a kid, whatever age they are, find out which one is age appropriate and get that if they don't have it already. Reminder, everything will be linked in our Amazon shop, which is linked down below. Clear for landing. A great thing that we've implemented into Benjamin's routine is getting an okay to wake light alarm clock thing. So it has a nightlight on it where you can turn it on. All right, turn the light off. So you can see it'll have an, uh, a light. But what happens is this actually will turn as a green light. Okay, light. It'll turn green and be a green light when it's okay for him to get up and come out of the room. So we just set it every day. It actually has the wrong time on it because every time our lights go out, like there's a what is it, power outage? Whenever there's a power outage, we have to reset it and I haven't reset it. He won't wake up any earlier and it won't necessarily wake him up if he's already in a good sleep pattern. So we really love it. I would encourage you to get it. And it's a really good for that in-between stage where they can't tell time but you need them to stay in bed because they're not in a crib. Do you like your okay to wake clock? Uh, yeah, dudes. <laughs> or grandmas. <laughs> dudes or grandmas? <laughs> so it's a great addition to the room great gift idea if you're looking for something and listen it helps out the parents and we're all about helping out the parents too so I'm gonna link that in the description box below and on our Amazon shop so go check it out if you're interested this is our map of of the United States of America. Let's get to it. Another great gift idea for kids is actually essential oils. We love plant therapy. I'm actually gonna leave a link in the description box below. We are affiliates with them now and we absolutely love them. We've been using them for years now before we even had a relationship with them. Every night I will diffuse one of their kids safe essential oils. So my favorites are Germ Destroyer, Immune Boom, and Sniffle Stopper. Yeah, you like that one? Sniffle stopper. Sniffle stopper. Yeah, we need to do that on yours tonight. Why? Because <laughs> you got the sniffles. And I also made a immune boom spray, which I like to spray on their pillows or on their stuffed animals, the one that they are like their favorite. And I used their Sweet Dreams blend and I made a little rollerball thing. I like to tickle their feet with that and put it right, right up here. <laughs> Come here, okay. let me show you. I'm gonna show them. Okay. I'm gonna show, show them. Show them how you put it on. Like this. On my cheeks and stuff. <laughs> well, mostly on your neck and on your feet, right? Yeah, like my feet. Like my feet. Let's tickle their feet. Ready? Tickle their feet. Tickle their feet. Tickle, 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 tickle. Tickle, 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 tickle. Let's do our neck. Let's okay. do our neck. Neck. So it's just a calming scent and it helps them to sleep and it helps them to know 
that it's a bedtime. It really helps with routine, which I'm a big routine person. <laughs> oh yeah, 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 you want that? We have been very pleased with every experience we've had with them, interactions, they have great customer service, free shipping a lot of times, so I would definitely check it out if you're interested. I love the Kid Safe blends like I just talked about, and lavender and lemon we use a ton everywhere else. So check out their latest sales because they're having a lot going on in December. The link is in the description box below. Another great idea is a ball pit. Now I know what you're thinking. I don't want all of those things strewn about my living area because they are gonna be picked up by me only. And yes, that may be partially true, but they are great and the kids absolutely love it. And so what we decided to do, we have to get some more balls actually this Christmas to fill this because I think you want to try to get, depending on the size of your pool, you need about a thousand. So we might get a couple more packs this year. This is the first thing I wanna talk about, which is the pool thing. So I'm gonna link it down below, but it's a pool that you can use with water, which we use outside all the time, but you can also bring it in and you can use it as a ball pit. And the amazing thing is it folds up to be really small. And it's not filled with air, which is great because my kids would just bounce on it and pop it in like two seconds. It's very sturdy. It has lasted us and it has really held up great. So it does double duty. It can do water outside and it can be your ball pit. Hey, it's like a two for one. I mean, how can you not get it now? And when you get the balls, I would recommend getting ones that are in a mesh case or planning to have something to put them in because you will not want to have them out all the time. You will want to bring them out for special occasions or when you know that you don't have to like pick it up in an hour because they will go everywhere. But they have so much fun with this, like they love it. Every time I pull it out, they just play in it like all the time. They throw blankets in here, they throw pillows and animals in here and they just like camp out in here. And it's just so cute and they really love it. And so I think it's such a great idea for kids. Another great idea for older kids especially girls, is one of our very own DIY natural lip balm kits. We just launched this this month and we're so excited to be able to offer you guys an easy, cute, affordable DIY for natural lip balm. It's so fun to do, it's so easy. Like we have made it so easy for you guys. You can do it with family and friends. You can give it as a gift as well as receive it. And the best part is that by purchasing this kit in December, we are donating 10% of our profits for the rest of 2020 to Hope for Freedom. Hope for Freedom fights against human trafficking and modern day slavery in the US. So by purchasing a kit this month, you are giving a double gift. Make sure you go to our website, ourfamilybee.com, or click the link in the description box below to go get yours now. Another great Christmas gift idea for kids is a splash pad. So we got this about the same time we got the pool, which we also use as a ball pit, and it is awesome. I'm about to turn it to go way up, but all you do is plug it into this hose. Brielle is in it, and it holds a little bit of water, so it's kind of like a little pool after it has <laughs> filled up the sides, which is like the rim and then it all like splashes over into the middle. And it's great because you can just hook it up to the hose and run it for as long as you want. But after you turn it off, there will still be some water in it. And so you can just play in that. Yeah. It's great, we use that and the pool at the same time usually, and they kind of go back and forth. And it does get a little slippery, so beware if you have little kids. Normally she wears some like water shoes, but they don't fit her anymore. So guess what she's getting I'm for Christmas. On water. I'm <laughs> Such a great gift idea. You don't have to have a huge yard. Like this is our patio and it's not very big. And so really you don't need a lot of space. You just need access to a hose and a little bit of land. So you can see how big it is in relation to them. <laughs> I would recommend it. Here we go. Here we go. Woo, look at how high that is. Yeah. Another great gift idea for kids is anything that's crafty. So paper for drawing, markers, crayons, colored pencils, whatever age they're at, something that's appropriate for them. So Benjamin lately has been really into having a composition book, just a plain, like I got it, you know, on Amazon or at Walmart, or wherever, and he just draws in it different imaginative things. So it's not like he's coloring a certain specific, you know, character or anything like that, but he just loves to draw and make up stuff. He sometimes practices words, which I think is great. Sometimes he'll use markers, colored pencils, regular pencils. There's a couple of things that I really love that I'll put in the shop below. And then also there's a really cool no mess coloring kit, which let me get it. 
which is great for kids, especially like on car trips or younger kids. So for Brielle, if she has markers, it will be on everything when she's done. I got this for when we went on our um, trip to Disney, which if you didn't see that vlog, I'm gonna link it down below too. But all you do is you have these markers, which look clear. They won't mark on anything except for the dedicated paper. So this is the Paw Patrol one that Benjamin got. So it's really cool, but it won't draw on your skin, which is great. So I'm gonna link these down below also. They are awesome, definitely worth it. They are obviously a little more expensive than just if you get a regular box of crayons and markers, but for certain occasions, I think it's really great because I hate messes and with kids, like they make a mess of anything you give them. So whenever I can try to minimize it, game changer for me. I do like the regular crayons and markers and paper and stuff like that, but also sometimes I really like to just give them this to color with because I don't wanna to have to worry about trying to like check on them every two seconds. But for our kids, at least this year, we are going to be getting a few different drawing items and crayons and markers and stuff like that. So if your kids or the kids you're shopping for really like to draw and be imaginative, definitely just get them a whole bunch of stuff that they can use their imagination for and call it a day. I'm popping in here to say this is not an exhaustive list. We are gonna actually link our blog down below so that you can check out a ton more ideas if you're looking for kids' gift ideas for Christmas. All the stuff we're mentioning in this video will be there plus some extras, so make sure you head over there to check it out. Adventures in Odyssey. That's right. Another great gift idea for kids is Adventures in Odyssey. Now, I listened to this growing up and they come in CDs, which I know is old school, but they're awesome to play in the car. Benjamin absolutely loves them. We have a ton of them. And they're great for uh, like fine tuning audio skills and listening to stories. Adventures in Odyssey is great for kids who can't even read yet because they can listen and they can follow along. And honestly, I love listening to it too because I get sucked in, especially like the mystery ones. And it's amazing because it gives a Christian story like moral behind it. So every end of the episode, they instill a virtue or a characteristic or a quality that a Christian should have. And so they have great lessons, which is awesome. Which one's your favorite? Family vacation. Family vacation one? What about the mystery one where they have to go to Israel? I don't know that one. That was one of the first ones we listened to. Oh yeah. Yeah, and they were chasing the people all over looking for artifacts and stuff. Yeah. Do you like Adventures in Odyssey? Yeah. <laughs> and now, Adventures in Odyssey called The Case of the Secret Room. It's parts one and two. It's definitely a good one. Everything will be linked in our Amazon shop, which is linked down below, but I'm trying to listen to it, so everyone needs to shh. Okay? Okay. okay. <sighs> Let's try that again, because I just recorded this all, and it was not even recording. YouTube fail. Another great gift idea is headphones. These are from Amazon. They fold up, they're super nice and easy, they're inexpensive, and they're great because if you need quiet, if they're on tablets or phones and they're allowed their screen time, but you need to have peace and quiet, or you have other kids that are competing with their phones or tablets, like it's great to be able to plug them in, give them their space and their time, and just have some peace and quiet. You know what I mean? These are great for car rides, great for school if they have to be you know, in the space with other kids. They're super comfortable, he likes them. You wanna fold them up? Yeah, fold them up. There you go. They fold right up. Yay! And the headphone you jack. just put them like this and put another one on top of it. Yep. And like wrap it up. Yep. And the headphone jack will go into either ear, so it's great because it's not dependent on one side. And we have been really pleased with them. These are great if you're listening to Adventures in Odyssey. So, so good. I like seriously want to go back in the car just so I can finish listening to the episode we were listening to earlier. Peace out. Another gift idea for kids that I would recommend is a bubble machine. So we actually have this semi-bubble machine we got from Disney, but any of the ones that will just sit and blow bubbles so that you don't have to keep dipping it in and blowing it yourself and dipping it in and then it spills and it's like a mess. So a bubble machine. I mean, I don't know if I know any kids that don't love bubbles. For how inexpensive they are, lots of kids can play with them at one time. I would definitely recommend a bubble machine. Bubble, bubble, bubble. Say bubble. 
Papa. Obviously, you can't get this one unless you go to Disney, but I'm gonna link some really cute ones down in our Amazon shop down below. So, make sure you check it out. And probably when this one dies, we're gonna get a bubble machine. I mean, can I recommend something for adults? Coffee? Like, necessary? Yeah, I think so. Another great gift idea is books, just plain and simple books. We have a few favorites that I'm gonna link in our shop down below, but we try to read every single night before bed, right? It's great for the kids to be able to spend that one-on-one -on -one cuddle time or even like if I have both of them with me and it's great auditory listening skills and it's great to instill in them a love for reading by reading to them when they're young. In a world where kids are so inundated with screens and commercials and so many fast-paced things, it's great to be able to sit down and just spend some Can slower time. Hey, hey, I'm, I'm recording here. I'm recording here. You can say it's great to be able to sit down and just have a slower pace and connect with them, read with them. Stand with the donkey, slide with the sheep. Scramble with the little pigs. <laughs> Give them your attention while doing something that will help them to learn and foster a love for reading. Because if you can read, you can do anything in your adult life. Ow. It is impossible to film with children. Other YouTubers, please let me know <laughs> if you feel the same way. I have little heroes that are action figures, little action figures of heroes, and we're going to go get them when Braille's up. Yeah, so another great idea is little action figure superheroes. We have the Avengers set, and they are upstairs, but they're such a good size. They're about this big, and Benjamin has played with them a lot. He interchanges them with other toys and uses them as the humans or the people, right? Yeah. Which one's your favorite? Uh, the green cape, and he uh -huh. cuts part of his body up, but it's still there. And the ones that don't have fabric on them, we take in the bathtub, right? Mm -mm. You like bath toys and taking stuff in the bathtub. What else do you take in the bathtub? Legos? Lego action figures. He loves taking Legos in the bathtub, so anything that can go mm -hmm. in the bathtub is a big hit. Hey, stop it. Hey, 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 I'm being attacked. Ah! I'm in the most terrible lighted room to tell you that bath bombs are another great gift idea for Christmas. They fit in your stockings. They are so fun for the kids. I mean, who wouldn't want a color-changing bath bomb that has a toy inside of it as a gift? I'm gonna link a cool set I found on Amazon that I'm getting our kids for Christmas. So you can check it out there. It comes with a little toy inside, which I think is so cute, and I think they're really gonna love it, and they're downstairs, and that's why I have to film upstairs in the bathroom so they don't hear me because I'm getting it for them. But it really just makes bath time so much more fun because I don't know about you, but sometimes it is a struggle for me to get the kids in the bath because all they wanna do is keep playing, and they know that that means that it's getting closer to bedtime, which they always want to avoid. I mean, I always am trying to go to bedtime. So bath bombs for Christmas for kids, great idea. Another great gift idea for boys or girls is binoculars. It's really cool to be able to like give it to them. They can like see how far they can like pick out things from in the car or like if you're just taking a walk. Benjamin used his so much that he broke them, but they were a big hit, right Benjamin? Yeah, so binoculars, another good gift idea. They're small and you can put them in the stocking even. Another great idea for a gift for kids is literally just pillows and blankets. Like anything soft and snuggly, my kids just gravitate towards. They love to just snuggle on the couch. They like to use it in their bed. They like to just walk around with it, use it as a cape. I mean, really, like you can't go wrong with pillows and blankets and like soft, you know, stuffed animals and stuff like that. We have to try to keep it to a minimum because they just love it so much but I think it's so sweet and so actually this year we're gonna get them a new fuzzy blanket each and so they can use it on their bed they can use it on the couch and who doesn't love to be cozy and warm especially during this time of year I mean if you want to go all fancy you can even get it like embroidered this was a gift for us but something soft fuzzy comforting warm I mean I think any kid would enjoy having that heck I would enjoy having that Another great idea for a gift for a kid is blocks. For multiple ages, blocks are such a great thing because you can do so many imaginative things. I mean, if you're not seeing a theme here, like I love imaginative play for kids because it's so great for their minds. So these little blocks, like Benjamin and Brielle can play with these. So a two and a five year old can both 
make something up, make a little house, make a fort, make a little road, make a little community, like anything. These are so great because they're wood, which I really like, and they're different colors, different shapes. Like, you can make all sorts of things. Blocks of any type are a great idea for a gift. I'm gonna link the kind that we have down below. They were a gift and they are awesome. Do you have any other great kid gift ideas? Leave them in the comments down below. And if you liked this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up because it really helps out our channel. It helps the YouTube algorithm to recommend us so that more people can find our community. We genuinely love getting to know you guys. If you don't follow us over on Instagram at OFB Social, we would love to connect with you in the comments over there. Remember, everything we talked about today is linked in the description box below. Whenever you make a purchase through our affiliate links, you're helping to support our channel so we we can make more of the content you love. If you haven't already subscribed, click the button below. And to check out more videos we've done, also click below. Thank you to all our supporters over on Patreon. We love getting to do life with you guys, and you guys are helping to make this vision possible. And if you want to help support us also, check out the link down in the description box below. Until we meet again, don't forget, life is better together.